Hey guys, it's been a while, been two weeks I think, maybe three, probably three. Um, I was going to make a video on Wednesday, but I didn't, so you're getting this today. It's late, it's dark, it's winter, woo! Tomorrow's the first day of December, yeah, are you excited? Because I am. How was your day? It's very interesting. Um, so today I'm going to be talking about my paranoia, because I have quite a lot of paranoia. Uh, yeah, I have a lot of paranoia. It's a bit worrying. First thing, first thing, this is like a big thing for me. Cars. I'm paranoid about a lot of things to do with cars. It's not like, it's not like, I don't know, getting into them. Like, I'm fine getting into them. It's like when I'm walking and there's a car. Like, whew, get away from me. Like, really, get it away from me. So I'll be like, I don't know, walking, and I'm like, hey, and then if this car, like, starts to pull up at the side of me, I'm like, uh, what are you doing? Are you trying to kidnap me? Because if you are, get out of my space. <laughs> Obviously, they're not trying to kidnap me, they just want that space that's there, but for some reason, I think they're going to kidnap me, and that terrifies me, the thought of being kidnapped. But... Another thing as well, like, when when you're just, like, walking, you're just chilling out, and then this, like, you, you're right at the side of the curbs, the curbs here, and you're, like, just, like, whoop, gonna step off the curve, off the curve, and then this car's, like, and you're, like, okay, back on the curve, and they're, like, you're, like, okay, they're letting me go, no! <laughs> Why? Why do people do that? Is it because they're like, oh, they're gonna cross the road, I better slow down. Oh, wait, they're waiting for me so I can speed up. And that's like when you, you're about to step off and you just accuse them of trying to run you over. Whew, that was fast to say. Like, I don't know. It's just, for some reason, I think that. Oh, and like, you're trying to cross the road. So if you're on the curb and you try and cross the road and you're just like, I won't really posh them. And then the cars like, could be like here and you're like, oh my gosh, run. Like, I don't, I do that all the time and I don't really understand why because I don't need to. I can easily get across that road walking, but for some reason, in my mind, I think I'm going to be run over. And I'm like, oh, run, run for your life. Oh, airports, like, ah, oh, airports. Like, when you're in that situation of the scanner, I feel like I need something to, like, just... Like, show it. <laughs> like, when you have the scanner, and then you're, like, walking through, and, like, for some reason, I have to check myself. I'm like, will my earrings set it off? No. Will my glasses set it off? No. Will my necklace set it off? No. Have I got my belt on? No. We're okay. And then I can go through, and then, like, you get through, and you're just like, whew, it's all okay. I got through. I'm safe. But for some reason, like, you know nothing's going to happen, because you, you're not carrying anything, like... A weapon or anything but you still feel like going through there is this massive task and it really annoys me because I don't understand why but I think the biggest thing that makes me paranoid about um, airports is like the ones in America tend to have like those guards and they've got guns and I'm like oh stay away from me because I think I think that's because in Britain we don't really like see many people with guns and you're like oh they have a gun oh my gosh they must be dangerous. No, it's like they're in the army or something. Like, this is something that happened to me personally. Quite a few of us did this. Uh, when we were in Paris on a school trip, they had the, the police walking around with guns. And we were just like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, act natural. Everyone, act natural. <sighs> we're okay, it's okay. Like, we hadn't done anything wrong. But for some reason, you just like see that and you're like, oh my gosh, they could shoot me. But like, Oh, I can't, no. I always think when I'm in an airport and I see them with guns, I'm like, oh my gosh, they're going to take me into custody. They're going to make me leave the country. They're not. But for some reason, I think they are. I'm a bit weird, to be honest. But, um, yeah. Oh, no. And trains. Trains, like, I get the train back sometimes because I don't live too far away from a train station. So, like, we have... A path here and a path here. Most people tend to walk along this path. But 
um i always so say like this a couple of people in front of me like do 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 i will run around them like i will be like Phew, till i'm at the front and they're all walking behind me like do 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 i for some reason have to be at the front i can't be behind people i cannot even if it means i have to run I cannot be walking behind people for some strange reason. My mind won't let me do that. I don't know if it's because I think I'm going to be kidnapped or whether I just can't stand walking behind people. I don't really know, but for some reason, I can't walk behind them. It's a bit weird, really. But yeah, I don't really know. Yeah. My second thing is when you're like... Because I don't, I'm not like paranoid about what people say about me because I really couldn't care less. I've been called quite a few things and I'm like, I don't care. But when you're like walking, like when you're not walking, maybe like if you're sat at a restaurant and like you're just sat there eating your dinner like, <laughs> and then the person opposite's just like, because I'm literally going to be sat there going, why are you staring at me? Why is this person staring at me? Keep eating. But I just, uh, I can't. Oh, I've got hat hair. Sorry. I just can't do that. I can't stand it. I might wear this hat now for the rest of the video. Because I look sassy. No, I don't really. <laughs> I just like this hat. But yeah, like, seriously, I don't understand why you have to stare at me. It's not like a paranoia thing, because I really, like I said, I really couldn't care less what people think. It's more like a paranoid, like, why are you staring at me? What is it that, make, that makes you stare at me? Have I got something on my face? <laughs> Cause you know, like, when you're looking and you're just like... Mm, sorry. And then you're, like, asking your friends, Do I have something on my face? Do I? Do I really? And they're like... No. I don't think so. Not that I can see. I'll be like, is my hair funny? <laughs> they're like, no, no, your hair's fine. I'll be like, is my hat funny? No, it's fine. Good. <laughs> but I just don't understand. Why? Why do you have to stare at me? Why? I don't like it. Ah. Uh, I'm just too paranoid. Tell me. That's what, that's what I want to hit here in the description. Not in the description. In the comments. That's the word, Alex. That's what I want to hear from you guys in the comments. What are you paranoid about? Please tell me that I'm not the only one that's paranoid. My hair is getting in my eyes. I'm sorry. But don't, like, what do you get paranoid about? And tell me if there's things that, like, you do that are the same as me. Please. I don't want to be the only one. Let's support each other in this. Let us support each other. If you have any funny stories to go with them as well, let me know. I love hearing about it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Tell me funny stories. Um, anyway, peace, love, and hugs, and I'll see you in my next video, but before that, I'm going to tell you a few little things. Oh yes, you get a bit of extra information. Um, basically, me and some of my friends, I don't know how many of us, but I need to ask a couple more of my friends. Um, before January, because that's when I have my mock exams, uh, we are going to do a little collab, so for the entire of January, you're going to get a couple of collabs. Thought I'd tell you early, because that's fabulous, and I hope you like it. Also, if there's anything that you want to see in December for Christmas, maybe it could be singing, it could be a collab, it could be a haul, it could be making something, cooking, I don't know, tell me and I will make it for you. Um, but yes, I will see you in my next video. Goodbye, I love you.